All right, anyone. Are you ready for another adventure? I, <laughs> I caught in that one. Are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, back with some more Dragalia Lost. Today, I'm actually going to finally use Galazena, a unit I've been seeing a whole bunch about, but haven't actually had the time to use her just because I've been so busy with everything. So I'm looking forward to that. Uh, this is Galazena. Um, from what I understand, she gets stronger the more HP she has, so I've given her an HP dragon like Jean the Arc because uh, she gives HP 60%. Uh, the Prince, I'm not 100% so sure on, because I'm not 100% sure what she would want. So I gave her more 4 strike damage. I gave her a 4 uh, charge, so she'd get her skills. Honestly, I think it might be better if I just start with Chocolatiers, and then... Uh, you know what? That might actually be better, now that I think about it. So she gets both skills right at the start. Actually, no. Because she's a healer. Hmm. You can tell me what you think. If you know better than me, I'll gladly listen, but she has Flurry Devastation and Skill Haste. I'm pretty sure I could probably use Paralyzed Punisher over one of these prints, but I don't know what Paralyzed Punisher is in my stack of Warm Prints. I have no idea how to find it again. It's lost for the time being until we get a better sorting. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to bring her into the Mercule Gauntlet, the Agudo for Light, and the High Dragon Trials for Light. So that's going to be today's video. If you end up liking it, you can leave a like, uh, comment about how you feel about Galazena or anything in the video, and you can subscribe to me if you want more Dragalia stuff. So, let's go right into Merkill. So I should say right now, yeah, the Shadow is the one that I have least trained, uh, mainly because I haven't really had a reason to use my light units until the new buff to 2.0, to Dragalia Lost 2.0. Um... I don't make any qualms about that, that's just the way it is. She's also currently holding a uh, High Dragon Trial weapon, by the way. My, um, Galazena. Alright, so, he is at least decently big, so let me use that, get my Force Strike out. Hit him with that. Do that. So it looks like I now have the ability to do... Of course he's gonna hit me out of it. And do this. And... Five. Jesus Christ! <laughs> that guy went real dead. Okay. I need to run that again now with a bigger one because I'm pretty sure that was her doing the damage there. Let's run that again. He should be bigger in this form too, I think. Because that was a lot of damage. I'm not sure if he was taking a lot of damage from that or just because he's not in a very uh, defensive-oriented move when he's in a smaller dragon form. This should be the start of the- yeah, there we go. Much better. Now that's someone to hit. Okay, let me see. I'm gonna use that. We wanna wait a bit until he's in overdrive. Use this. Perfect. Okay, now let's see. She should have that, so I'll full four strike, wait for it to be done, go overdrive, and then hit him. <laughs> That's funny. It's, it's She's not even super well optimized. So it's kind of like Marth, where she just deals a lot of damage if you can get that full four strike out on her. Well, not Marth, but, you know... Um, not Marth, Krom, where he has a move that gets extremely strong. Okay. Damn, that did a lot of damage. I wonder how she fares in the other one. He was also in a Punisher state. Um, let's head into Advanced Dragon Trials now. Go here, I Zodiac. I still need to learn this fight a little bit, so if I die or make mistakes, forgive me. I'm not lying when I said I ignored this fight for a vast majority of it. Because I just could not find good teammates for it. But now that it's on solo and they've removed cages, it's much easier for me. Okay, let's see. There he is. I must hold myself together. And with that, and then heal everyone. Let's make this conflict history. Did I hit him with that? Does that count? It does in fact count. Okay, so let me see. Go here. Oh, so you see the stars around it. Okay. Oops. So I can hit him from all the way back here. Wow, that's crazy. I can. 
Wow, okay. Use that. Let me see, is your skill ready? No, okay. Okay. Now it's time to hit him where it hurts. That wasn't even fully charged because I didn't. Ha I wanted to hit him while he still was in break state in some time. Was that? I can keep going thanks to you. And with that, there. Now he's dead. Interesting. Okay. Pick some up here. Hmm. I'm gonna run this one back one more time. See if I can. Um, Get the four strike fully when he's in break state. No. Save that for mastery. Um, yeah, that should be enough. Yeah, one gold should be perfectly enough. Oops. And it's about to freak out on me, isn't it? So I'm gonna pause it. We'll be right. Okay, it didn't. Oh man, okay. That. Do that. Heal everyone a bit. I forget. Constantly. Okay. Let me use that. Charge up big. Use this. And then use that. Hopefully get our skills up. He's already in overdrive, which is not good for what I want to do. Damn it. He entered break too quickly. That should be- no, it's nowhere near enough. Alright, I'm good, Jean. Actually, let me hit quick retry. Try and do that again. Just one more time to hit him when he's at break state, just to see how it is. This time I'll be smarter about it. I'll hold on to my four strike for a bit. There's really no reason for me to four strike at the beginning. Yeah, something like skill haste might be better. I don't know. I wonder why you would build her. If you want to tell me how you've been building her, if you've been using her, I'd be glad to hear. Um... I would look at the DPS. I mean, it is updated, but also their DPS can be a little bit wonky at times. Let's say as bad as sometimes their prints are meant for uh, playing a very specific way to get the maximum DPS out of them. Okay. Yeah. But they are good for just looking at. It. I should have just looked at. It. Oops. Okay, he's in overdrive now. Who's that? Okay, so I'm gonna start charging now. They're gonna get him in overdrive pretty soon. Boom. Hmm. That was okay, but I think it would have been better if she would actually buff by something. Oh, I can you do it again. Ooh, that doesn't look good. So I'm just in this fight. I could definitely see, with the right setup, she could deal a lot more damage than what I'm currently using with my things. At least if Mercurial is anything to be based off of. Okay. And then we're gonna go to the last fight. Cancel. Who is, of course, Tartarus. And I'm going to be going standard, because I have not trained at all for expert. At all. Not even in solo play. 17. Perfect. Perfect, as I say, as I use 2 as opposed to 1. So it was not actually perfect. Okay. But so far, I'm really liking her. She seems a very interesting mix of killing and also just straight up healing, which is nice. A harm assist. Let's go with him. Go here. What is that? I have to also take a close look at how everyone else is doing. Move out of the way. Okay, charge. Three, four. 
Alright. She also can hit from so far away. Let's see, is the door open yet? No, the door is not open. There are specific things to do with doors in this fight. There he is. Hit him with that. There it is, okay. I've wondered if I should go into it with Zena. Who did who went in there? It's me, okay. Alright, she's got this. No problem. Tonk. Leave my sight. Alright. It's also tracking. Okay, hit him with the... Perfect. Oh, I should have been closer. Okay, get him right there. Ow! <laughs> I should get out of the way of the sword, huh? There we go. Let me see, do I need to heal right now? No, I don't. Did someone get hit with something? Yeah, she totally did get hit with something. Alright, let's kill him. That should be enough. There you go. I was about to say, there's he's so close to death. Alright. That's that for that. I'm definitely interested in getting her built up, but where did the prince go? <laughs> where <laughs> where's where's you then? <laughs> he was in there somewhere. He's gone now. Rip and peace the prince. Well, that's it for today's video, everyone. I hope you liked it. I definitely like Zeno a whole bunch. Um, the very interesting kind of healer. I kind of wish that a lot of co-op stuff wasn't a lot of cheese, because I would love to play her co-op. But I had that's what solo is for, right? So now I can use her in solo and just happy, be happy, play well, and hit everyone with the big old staff when I want to. But that's the end of today's video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Have a good day.